out there. Obviously, you guys were struggling to get hits. Got a guy on hit by pitch, two walks at the stage for you. I mean, what, what were your what was your mindset stepping up there at that moment? Um, it's always big time when you can get uh especially their Friday night guy out. But when you can get the starter out and get to someone's bullpen, um, usually there's a little like sigh of relief and uh, their starter had good stuff and he was keeping us uh, off balance all night. But they brought in a kid that was two pitch guy, fastball, curveball. So once I saw two curveballs that were balls, I was just sitting on the fastball and trying to put it in play. And that's now your third grand slam of the season. It's not like you're hitting these when you're up a lot or down a lot. You're hitting these in pretty crucial pressure situations. What is it, what is it about these moments that allows you to just lock in and thrive? Well, I mean, when you get the bases loaded, that means three guys in front of you on your team grinding out at bat and put the ball in play and did what they needed to do to give you a chance to uh, succeed. So um, I just try to stay short and put it in play. And uh, with that many base runners, if, if I can get a or put a good bear on it, then uh, more than likely it works out pretty, pretty well. Another game where you guys really come alive late to, to come back, and you know, what's the I guess what's what's the say about this team, the ability to do that over and over and over? Um, I think that shows a lot, especially uh, what we went through last year. And I love last year's team, but it just wasn't a team that would normally come back. We start to get down in the dumps and not um, be able to respond. But I mean, we just. We had so much trust for each other, um, especially in the lineup that at any moment, like we can put up a, a nine spot. And um, when you got faith like that, and um, it just takes a couple swings and it's contagious. And yeah, we just all play for each other and it works out. Obviously the hitting kind of struggled for the first six innings, but how much of a boost did it kind of give you guys knowing that uh, Poland's out there on the mound, kind of grinding out, doing the best he can? No doubt. Uh, I said this before, Poland, doesn't get as much credit for everything he's done this year. We haven't played the best defense behind him, um, especially early in the year. And JP's a dude. He's going to get drafted early on. He throws a lot of strikes, and he just competes up there. And he gave up two bad swings to a kid that has some of the most juice in the country. So, no, nah, anytime JP's out there, along with uh, the rest of our pitching staff, we feel very comfortable. So I'm up in the press box as the game's starting. I'm like, who's that on first? What's up with the, the big change on, on top here? <laughs> uh, I was telling Sean, I've had the long hair for about two and a half years now, and I'm a big sweater, so it's starting to get hot and needed to change it up, and uh, I guess it worked for me.